here we go, our crew's trying to get it off the trailer, but of course they've only got a stern line attached. My man's tossing a line, trying to get a bow line set up, but nothing but whiffs on those attempts. And of course, with only a stern line as they pull in, they're only going to drag the stern in and the bow's going to kick around. Welcome back, guys, to the greatest show on earth, and that is the Miami Boat Ramps channel. I'm your host, Broncos Guru, in collaboration with our boy Wavy Boats, and it's another Wavy Guru Productions back at the ramp, and today we are visiting 79. And these guys have this thing almost all the way turned around now. So we're doing the switcheroo. My man grabs the line. Our guy just went under the seat, turned the batteries on, so I'm assuming he's going to put some power behind this. But he's in reverse. He's going to reverse into the dock, and he's hitting the dock. I don't know if that's what he meant to do. I mean, I'm imagining not, but I mean, I guess in the end it'll get the job done. But man, just reverse right into it. And our crew's backing up. I guess it's gonna take a running start at this one again. They missed the first attempt. Let's see how they fare as they reset up and try and make a second approach. And here we go. Cap bringing it in. And this time they're coming in a little hot. Cap's coming in with intent. Gonna have to break check. Oh, they're gonna smack again as well. Oh, my man was just coming in hot. Had to pull the brake check off. When he did, it pulled him back into the dock. He's still in gear, bro. Neutral, neutral. And he's still playing around with power, it looks like. But we've got people off with lines, man. At that point, put her in neutral. Let them do the work. And here comes one of our 79th Street regular crews. We actually see these guys, it feels like almost every weekend anymore. And let's see how they fare as they make their approach. They're taking their time, trying to figure out which dock they're gonna come on. We got Wifey in the bow, Junior on the stern. It appears both people have lines too, so we're kind of set. I think that's a fender in the water. My man looking good. Got a good pace. Angle doesn't look terrible. Let's see if Wifey can get over to bow rail. And there she leans, she almost falls in, stumbles over it, but gets it off onto the dock. Here we got the ladies bringing it in. Pronautica, I don't know that I've ever really heard of that brand. Let me know in the comments below if it's something you guys are familiar with. App looks like she's got a good approach angle, good speed. Vendors out. Crew looks like they're on the ready. Now they do have the mat on the same side they're docking inside the boat, which can make things a little more difficult. But man, following the golden rule, never approach the dock any faster than you're willing to hit it. And our girl's got one hand on, quickly back off. And we're gonna get shot blocked as they're trying to finish up. And they double step off. No issues, the ladies getting it done. And we got a couple floaters. 
Another thing that's not uncommon down here at 79. And the current's just kind of dragging them out back toward the bay. And I'm wondering if that's their new home. So if anybody's looking for a couple jet skis, come on down here around 79th and just look for a few floating off into the bay. They're probably yours if you want to grab them. And of course we love it when we get the wave to the camera. Ladder down, another 79th Street regular thing. Cap, I think, is going to change his approach here. It looked like he was coming in on this first dock, but has decided he is not going to attempt that. I think he thought he was going to go right on the end cap. Got another boat coming far to the outside. Going to try and go around him. Gotta love these captains where they're just not waiting. If you're in there messing around, they're going right to business. So my man is gonna snake in here on the first boat that was kind of just chilling. And here he goes. He's not even hesitating, making approach on the dock. Our first captain's gonna come to the right, second captain to the left. It looks like they're both gonna go in, double docking scene. Up top, fits it in like a glove, leaves the helm. Gonna do the solo job and finish it off himself. Done like a pro. And our second crew is just floating off, looking in awe. And walking it in the tightrope. Our guy stepped on the other boat on the side here and just used the other person's boat. A walk it across. I mean, not a bad plan, but you never know how that one's going to go. When you see somebody stepping onto some random person's boat, I always kind of wait for somebody to come either running out from the cabin or running down the dock like, what are you doing, bro? But here, he was just trying to make his way up and get this to the inside dock and tie off. But the crew's got it up there, and they've got it put away, and they should be good to get out of here from here. And speaking of getting out of here, we're going to get out of here as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miami Boat Ramps. If you did, please check out our other content. We have Wavy Boats, who does a bunch of great things down at Hallover Inlet. My channel, Broncos Guru, do some great comedy boating videos there as well. And of course, we've got Boats vs. Hallover, where Man and Machine take on Mother Nature down at Hallover Inlet. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.